Hi, welcome to Solid Edge 2020 video tutorial. I want to do the slide and tilt mechanism in Solid Edge. And you will see it's quite easy to do. Let's show how it works or that it works. Switch here to physical motion and switch there to freeform move. Then you can grab that part here and move it along this slot and it also tilts and moves along the second slot here. Now let's have fun with Solid Edge. Okay, I've already created a new and empty assembly. Let's bring in our first part which will be grounded automatically and that would be the guide part. There you go. Okay. And then bring in the second part, which will be the tilting part. And just put it there. Okay. Maybe change the colors. So let's go for this one, maybe for yeah, aluminium. And that one, maybe a blue color. Like that. Looks okay. Let's turn it around. So now I need a mate between this surface and that surface here. So go for home, go for that planner mate or mate. So this surface and that surface should be mated and OK. Now I have to position that tilting part so it will work. So this has to be inside that slot. And this one here has to be inside that slot. And then we go to physical motion. Now let's move our tilting part a little bit at least with no analysis and with freeform move. So grab it and move it over there. So it's almost already in the correct position. And confirm this. Now in order to position it correctly, I want to use a tangent constraint. And that would be this symbol. So I want it to be between this surface and that surface. Right click and also between this surface and maybe that one or I could even go for this one. Doesn't really matter. Is it correct or have a, it seems to be correct. So confirm. Now it might move only on that surface. So I will suppress that constraint here. Let's go to our Assembly Relation Manager and I want to suppress this one because I need it only for the correct positioning. Now if we go to Drag Component and switch to Physical Motion and to Freeform Move, you will see it will move along that slot and along the other slot. So that's really very very easy to do in solid edge so i hope this was helpful hope you liked it if you did like it please give it a like or leave a comment if you want to see more please give it a like or leave a comment please subscribe to my youtube channel please subscribe to my facebook cap fan page would be very nice if you i want to get more likes and subscriptions over there as well thanks for watching see you to the next one bye bye